IPVM researches major changes in the physical security industry driven by cloud, AI, and lots of funding. So far this year through June, IPVM has published 400 plus reports. Here are 12 specific developments especially worth watching. They may succeed, they may fail, but they are big bets. In alphabetical order, 3SI is purposefully keeping a low profile, but with a new CEO, formerly running Stanley Security Products, acquiring a growing VMS developer, Surveil, and backed by an experienced security-focused PE firm, they are planning significant expansion. Aerodome is backed by mega VC firm A16Z, and they are trying to do police first responders, what Flock has done for police LPR. Axis has re-entered the VSAS market with its open platform Cloud Connect. Upcoming IPVM testing will evaluate if this is a credible alternative to hostage as a service. Axon, best known for its tasers and body cameras, is making a big push in video surveillance. It acquired fast-growing Fusus, aiming for billions in revenue. Dean Draco, owner of Brevo and Eagle Eye, has acquired Cobalt Robotics, changing its name to Cobalt AI. IPVM explained the failure of Security Robotics version 1.0, but Cobalt's pivoting to AI monitoring has potential. Evolve admitted it's under investigation by the SEC, and it slashed its revenue guidance. IPVM has exposed the company's deception over the last few years. Generative AI, most well-known with ChatGPT, is sweeping the world in video surveillance. Many companies are working on theirs. IPVM explained how VIT's visual inference transformers will soon impact this market. Plus, look out for IPVM's own GPT AI agent later this year. Genetech, one of the largest and now oldest VMS developers, has launched a major new cloud architecture, Security Center SaaS. HID has had a turbulent 2024 so far, disclosing high severity vulnerabilities, abruptly EOLing its Mercury Redboards and conducting layoffs. Honeywell closed its acquisition of carrier access, including Linnell S2. IPVM explained how Honeywell's focus on cash generation is positive for investors, but bad for customers. Rapid SOS raised $150 million, plus launched 911 camera sharing, showing the power of cloud connecting conventional physical security with public safety. Mega distributor ADI has been struggling to grow revenue, but now spending nearly a billion on Snap One, they are trying to reinvigorate themselves. Vosker has raised $125 million, aiming for a billion annual revenue in the growing cloud connected cellular solar power market that IPVM is bullish on. So much is happening, this does not even include developments from Dawa, Hike Vision, Motorola, and Verkata. Companies IPVM has published dozens of reports on this year. This is one of the most eventful years in the 15 plus years IPVM has been analyzing the market. Stay informed and make the right strategic decisions by learning more from IPVM's reporting on these developments.